And Ethan Long spends time with us now. Ethan, congratulations. You and I have been doing this together for many years. It's fun to reunite and have a conversation. It was made clear to me, Ethan, yesterday by your shortstop, Sean McClain, that your team needed to win three games to get things back together. You guys are two of your first two. Would you agree with that thought that, you know, you guys needed to come out here and right the ship and sweep this series? Absolutely. I mean, uh, it's nice to get the two wins out of the way, but we're still not satisfied. we got another game tomorrow, and we're going to try to come out and do the same thing. We just showed what would be a nice resume for you for the last couple of days. I love your approach today. And by the way, your sack fly, I thought that should have been a double off the wall. You crushed it. <laughs> I mean, let's talk about your approach today. You've used the whole diamond, right field, left field. How proud are you of, of the way you've approached things in the box? Uh, I'm a lot more comfortable for sure. Um, being able to drive the ball to right field is my go-to really, and if I can do that, I know I'm on the right track for everything. So just being able to drive balls right field is my main goal, and then if they make a mistake and come middle of the plate or middle end, then I can pull it with ease. So I'm happy with where I'm at right now and hopefully can keep it going. So over the last year, and the season of 16 homers comes to an end, you play for the collegiate national team. Where have you evolved the most as a hitter, would you say, since last season came to an end? Where have you grown the most? Um, personally, I would say the mental side. Uh, it's kind of overshadowed. Um, getting in the cage, getting all your work, everybody knows about that. But having a routine every day, journaling when you're going good, to be able to go back when you're struggling and read all that stuff, it's really helped me. So being able to get stronger mentally, really, as a hitter and learn from my past mistakes and past achievements has been really helpful. Is it a digital journal or an old-fashioned journal with a pen or a pencil? It's old-fashioned. I don't get to write much nowadays. A lot of school's online, so i got to get my writing in somehow. You know, you know that veteran <laughs> Connor Davis, right, that old guy who, oh, who's yeah. on your team? He's such a good leader, such a good mentor. Reach up on your cap, Bill, on, on the right side. Reach up. Yeah, that's what he left you. I mean, that's the kind of leadership you get from a veteran. Hey, congratulations <laughs> on a good day. It's, it's good to you. Like I said, you and I have done this many times. It's great to reconnect. Yes, sir. It was good talking to you again. Thank you.